afternoon tube and how are we all happy new year to everyone or shall i say a rollover because we're in the same situation we were last year aren't we so uh, yeah it's a quick update video i thought i'd pop on and say hello it's been three months two months i don't even remember now um say some hi to some new subscribers that have uh have, have subscribed to the channel so thank you very much for that thank you for the support um just give you kind of a quick update on what's to come in the next 12 months and a bit of a breakdown as to what's been happening in the last two months so over the next 12 months we're hoping to be getting one camp per month um in uh, so obviously what it's going to be tweaked 12 camps plus uh the dartmoor trip which will be in the summer i'm not sure what date um and also in the planning of a airsoft weekend uh with a couple of mates um it's going to be an interesting weekend if we can get it sussed and um, so what's been happening not a lot we're still in the same situation um we haven't found anywhere to move to ourselves yet so we're still staying with a friend um, i'm out on my own today no calibre because last Thursday she got bitten by a rat um, on her dew claw and it's quite severe um, we've been she's been on she's been given antibiotics and we've had to strap it um, I'll put a picture somewhere up here in a little bit um, but yeah so we've had we've just come out of COVID isolation because a member of the household where I'm staying um, contracted and was positive for COVID the rest of us are absolutely fine uh, we all got tested and we all negative and um, it was just that one person and it was really weird kind of experience for the, the, the 12 14 days whatever it was um, because that person had to isolate in the bedroom um, we had to wear masks and gloves um, at like dinner times to, to give them their, their dinner and, and take their plates and, and cups and stuff downstairs to get washed up we had to wash everything up separately and with boiling water and uh, you had to wash it all wearing gloves and, and things like that so yeah it was a, a weird experience um actually they were they were fine they were quite asymptomatic really they were at a little bit of a temperature and some coughing um and that was why we did the that's why they did the, the test um and yeah come back positive um but before that they were wandering around the house with all of us um without having a care in the world like really because we had no idea um, even when they got symptoms we didn't really think much of it it was just we just thought do you know what get tested see what happens see what the crack is i'm um, sorry if there's a bit of wind I'm trying to block the camera but i've left my tripod at home it's kind of a off the cuff um video of this because i haven't done one for so long and i've been wanting to get out for weeks and weeks to do one but it's just been one thing after another with covid and then the dog and with the Christmas and New Year period and, and all of that and um, weather's been really, really bad. We haven't really had a break in the weather, to be honest. It's just been terrible um, and it was pointless coming out and, and getting everything absolutely saturated just for a, a 10 minute video or whatever. Um, so yeah, this year's looking really good. Um, we've been in contact with lots of YouTubers, um, lots of Instagrammers. Um, who are willing to collab this year obviously as and when lockdown is um is is sorted or lifted um obviously that's put, just put jeopardize on, on on me driving really um but again being able to get out and about and and um and do certain things that i wanted to do but we're just getting by we're getting on with it um life's good really good actually uh yeah it's been eventful it was a really good christmas and uh, new year period so i hope everyone enjoyed and um, had the best christmas and new year possible it was a weird one um but do you know what i mean for one year oh hang on let me just get past this person sorry about that just had to pass someone on the path but see two meter distance and all that um so yeah it was uh, a weird christmas and new year but it was a really good one and um, we're all doing really well. Calber's healing. Oh, hang on. It's like the M5 on this road, on this path at the moment. Oh, really, oh, it's all really wet and horrible. So um, yeah, I've actually to just pop out and just do a antibody test for my friend. Um, 
see if they've actually had COVID at any point. Um, because it's, again, it's just really weird that none of us got it. Um, but yeah, back to the channel. Um, it's looking really, really positive for 2021. So it's going to get out and do camps um, and things like that. And like I said, really looking forward to finally getting out. So we really wanted to get out this weekend. Um, but I just can't with Calva's leg. Um, it's too... It's too bad, and if she gets it really mur like muddy and, and filthy, it's just going to get infected, and it's absolutely pointless. Um, it's already cost me an arm and a leg to, to get sorted. But, yeah, it's not too bad. It's really murky, as you can see over there. But it's actually really nice to be out and about. Obviously, we had 14 days of not being able to leave the house, um, which was really hard going. I mean, obviously we've got a big garden and stuff, but it was really hard going, not being able to go anywhere for 14 days. Um, but we got through it and we're out the other side of it. And now we're uh, back to reality. So yeah, um, we've got some new kit. We've got some new cameras. And what I'll do is um, I'll show you kit bits of kit and equipment and I'll attach them to the end of this video. Um, Cause I won't, I'll just pause this and then come back to it when I get home. Yeah, I thought I'd bring you out. It's a really nice day, actually. I mean, it is, what, 20 past four now? 16, eight, 16, 18, it's 11 degrees. So, it hasn't been, it's not too bad. But um, yeah, I'll leave this here whilst we're out and about. Um, I'll get home and I'll show you the other little bits um, that we've got camera-wise um, and things like that. And um, yeah. They're not the most expensive cameras in the world, but for what we're doing, I don't need to be paying like hundreds of pounds. I know people spend hundreds of pounds on GoPros and things like that, but I just don't have the money to do that. So we're not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that until the point, at such a point, I'm, I'm coming out every single week or every weekend or everything like that. Got, got my phone. So yeah, we'll um, see you back at home and I'll show you the little bits that we've got. Uh, again, really sorry for the sound if, it, if it's terrible, the wind, I don't have a muffler, it's only my phone that I'm using. So, um, yeah, see you when we get back home. So I said when I got home, I'd show you the cameras that we've got. So it's just these sports cameras. No dog's getting in the way. Oh, I know it's bloody had water and it slathered it all over me. Great. Just these sports cameras from Wish. Get your bloody head out of the way. I've got a blue one. These are all different kind of connections and things. Sorry, lights, a bit crap. And then this one, pink one for Calva, because she lost the other one. Oh, when I moved out, I couldn't find it. So yeah, they're just cheapy little um, GoPros. They're waterproof, different things. Some specifications if anyone's interested. To look at that. So yeah, that's just the cameras that we've got. And um, it's nice to be back. And um We'll bring some more videos as and when. What? When we can get out eventually. Um, so yeah, we'll um, see you soon.